Today, I'm going to show you how to create a website for your coffee shop really easy in an instant using Mighty Sites. So if you're not familiar with Mighty Sites, it's only $9 a month and it's a great way to create a local business website that's simple and professional. So to show you, I'm just gonna start by looking up the coffee shop website template. Here it is, um, let me click on it. First thing it's gonna ask, tell me about your coffee shop. So I'll just say Keegan's Coffee Shop. And then where am I located? Denver, Colorado, and then type of business. This is a service, uh, restaurant business, excuse me. So then I click continue. It's gonna ask me a few more questions. So like what my phone number is for my business and what my email address is. So I'm gonna add that to, and then I just click continue. It's gonna ask me where my coffee shop is located. So I'm just gonna put in an example right now and click continue. And then it'll just ask me what times I'm open. So let's just say I'm open from 6 a.m. until let's just say 4.30 p.m. on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. And then let's say on Saturday, I'm open from 6.30 until, let's go a little later, until 5 p.m. And then uh, let's just say I'm not open on, on Sunday at the same time. So on Sunday, I'm just gonna say, let's pretend we're closed just so you can see what that looks like. So now it's gonna just ask me to review the basic information about my coffee shop. If that looks good, I click looks good next. And just like that, Mighty Sites is actually going to generate the template for me. So it's going to generate a simple professional website template for my coffee shop with images, pre-written text, all of that included without me having to do anything other than enter my basics business information. Now, what I can do from here is just fill out the template a little bit more. So if I want to, I can go to update location. I can choose to show my email on the website if I prefer, but I don't have to. I can also go to social media links and, and add in, let's just say my Facebook page. Uh, let's add my Instagram too. And again, you can just copy and paste your sites, but people are gonna find your website and might be interested in seeing your social media sites too. So I'm gonna save those. Now I've got my social media links uh, included at the top. I can update the menu and the menu here means the navigation item. So let's just say I wanna add a new nav item here. I'll just, I'll just put in navigation and then select where that links. I can link to another website, to my website, to action items, a PDF. Let's just, I'll just link to the about section for now and confirm, add that to my menu, click save. And now you're gonna see I've got a new navigation item there too. So then I can go over here to update this section and I can actually um, update my logo too. So if you have a logo, just go ahead and upload it. If you don't, you can always leave it as just saying the text there, um, or you can create a logo in some place like Canva or something like that. So I'm actually, let me show you how that works because I think that would be helpful. If I just go to canva.com, I can create a logo. Most of their options are really cheap or free. Um, and let me just put in here coffee and see what I get. So you can see it'll give me like a coffee shop logos I can choose from. So without me having to do anything, um, let's just say that this is what I want my coffee shop logo to look like. I'll just put it here. Let's call this my co coffee shop logo and I'll download it. Uh, JPEG's always best for the web. So I'll download it as a JPEG version. And then I'll let that download, go back over here to my Mighty Sites website builder, grab my logo, upload it. And you'll see it'll upload in the screen here. And just click save. And now my logo's there. Now I can make it bigger by clicking on the make it bigger button or make it smaller. Or I can click on this little pencil icon and I can actually get in here and make some edits. So let me get in here and actually, I'm, I'm gonna crop it a little bit. Um, and then you can see there are all these image editing tools built right into Mighty Sites to make it so you can edit logos or pictures, anything that you upload. So I'm gonna change that, uh, just crop it a little bit, resave it, and now you can see it's a little bit bigger there. It got rid of some of that white space around it. So now that's looking pretty good. Um, so I'm gonna go down here and if I want to change any of the colors, so let's just say, you know, you, you know, red is more your color or green, you can actually just go through all these different color palettes and find the one that you feel like works best for your business. And I'll just save this one for now. It's really just a matter of preference and you can choose the style that, you know, you prefer for your coffee shop too. Um, so you can just pick the, the website template. So I'm gonna go in here. If you offer order online, that's great. You can just link to it. Um, if you just want people to do something like 
um, you know, uh, call or email for information. You can change that button to do that, or you can just get rid of the button altogether just by deleting if you don't want a button there too. So you can do any of those options with the call to action buttons on the website. You can also edit any of this hero text. So you can just type in what you wanted to say. So local owned and operated, um, you know, let's just say we love making coffee, right? So whatever, whatever it is, or specialty coffee, you can just type in what you want. And then the other neat thing, you can upload a new image here if you have a different image, or you can search the photo library that comes pre-built with this and just select from any of the, the images that you want. So you can just search here, coffee, coffee shop, and just see all of the tons of images built into the system for you to use on your website too. So whatever, whatever it is you prefer. Um, and then as I go here, I can update this. This will automatically, when they click on this, it'll open up directions. So that's uh, something that is pretty consistent people want, but I can go in here and update my hours. I can update that action button to say something different or link somewhere else if I'd prefer. Um, and then I can obviously edit any of this text. So if I wanna say, you know, this is how you make a website for a coffee shop. I can just type that in there and save it. It's nice and easy to do. And then I can also make, you know, I can make it italicized or bold or um, any of those things. Now there's a view our menu button here. So if you want, the easiest way to do this, you can either link to another website that has your menu or your Google business profile or things like that. Or you can just upload a PDF of your menu. That's the most common use. So if I just browse here, let me just look for, I've got like example menus on here. Let me just pull up this example menu. So this will load, I'll just confirm it and save. And so now let me just refresh this. So now if someone comes to the site and they wanna see like my menu of coffee or food, now they just click on it, it opens a nice little easy PDF there of my menu. And that's the same thing. If I click on menu here, it'll bring me right here to where I can open the menu on the website. So really, really nice and easy to use. Um, so that's it. So just like that, I basically created a simple professional looking website for my coffee shop that I can now use to market my business. And I can add directions. I've added my menu. If I wanted to add this, uh, another button here, I could add one on the hero, but I don't have to either. Um, and just like that, if I go to stop editing the site dashboard, I can connect my custom domain and I'll just have a set of instructions for what I need to update with my registrar. And Mighty Sites will connect and provide me with a secure certificate. And now for $9 a month, I've got a simple professional website for my coffee shop. Click on the link below this video. You can actually uh, click on that to start a free trial. Give it a shot and see if this works for you. But hopefully have a nice, simple, professional website uh, up and running for your coffee shop in no time. Wishing you the best of luck.